Hi, my name is Lisa Allen. Welcome to this English lesson. In esta lección tenemos un objetivo, usar verbos compuestos y la palabra will para responder a peticiones. El contenido conceptual es verbos compuestos, palabras como pick up, turn off, clean up, put away y mucho más, y la palabra will para responder a una petición. El profesor de inglés va a explicar un proyecto especial. Empezamos con la lección. Here we have verb combinations. These are little verb phrases that we use together to say, to give an idea. For example, they are pick up, put away, turn up, clean out, turn off, turn on, write down, clean up, turn down, shut down. And it's possible that there are others, but we're going to work with these 10. Now, these com verb combinations can be used to make a request, a petition. And this is very kindly stated. Will you shut down the computer? Notice, if it's a petition, there, it's in the form of a question. Will you, the verb combination, and the thing that we're talking about, shut down. Now, we can also give this same sentence more like an order, a command. Shut down the computer. Now it's not a question, it's an order. Shut down the computer. Now, how do we respond? We take the same will that came from the question and we put it with I. I will, and we say, I'll shut the computer down. We're going to separate the verb combination and put the object in the middle. I'll shut the computer down. Or we can also change the computer, which is one thing, to it. I'll shut it down. You can say in front of the word, okay, or sure, or yes. Then you say the I will, which we say I'll in the contraction. The first part of the verb combination, the noun or pronoun that you're talking about, and the second part of the verb. Let's continue to explain. Here are some more examples. Requests. Requests that people can make with these verb combinations. For example, number one, will you pick up your clothes? This is very kindly stated, a petition or a request. Will you pick up your clothes? The response, yes, I'll pick them up. What happened? We took the word will that we need to respond and we put it with I, I'll. Then we took clothes and there are more than one and so we put the word them in middle between pick and up, the verb combination. Number two, turn off the TV. Okay, I'll turn it off. Separate turn off and there's only one TV, it. Three, clean out the car. Sure, es como, claro que sí. Sure, I'll clean it out. Separate clean and out and put it because there's one car. Four, put away your school books. Okay, I'll put them away. Number five, turn on the radio. Sure, I'll turn it on. Now note, them and it are the only pronoun options. If you're talking about something that's plural, more than one, use them. If it's singular, just one, use it and put them or it between the parts of the verb combination. Let's practice. Answer these questions. Will you clean up the desk? This is a polite request, a petition. Now I'm going to answer with I and will. Remember, I'll. Yes, I'll clean it, one desk, up. Will you turn up the volume? Volume is singular. Sure, I'll turn it up. 
Number three, turn off the music. Now this is an order because it's not in the form of a polite question. This is a command. Turn off the music. Okay, I'll turn it off. And number four, pick up the erasers. I'll pick them up. Them because erasers is plural. A little bit more practice. Number five, will you turn down the bed? Yes, I'll turn it down. Six, put away the stapler, please. Okay, I'll put it away. Seven, write down your homework assignments. Notice assignments is plural. Okay, I'll write them down. There are many new vocabulary words in this lesson. Pick up, clean up, turn on, turn up, shut down, command, desk, bed, homework assignment, turn off, put away, turn down, write down, petition, clothes, volume, and stapler. Hemos alcanzado nuestro objetivo. Formar oraciones usando verbos compuestos y la palabra will para responder a peticiones. Y estos verbos compuestos son nuestro contenido conceptual. Thank you very much. 